Yo, what's going on guys? It's Nsopoli and welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are having an absolutely fantastic day and welcome to the seventh episode of uh, Red Dead Redemption 2 story. Um, I've had to redo this episode like three or four times because for some reason my bitrate was actually set to like 16, it was 160,000 and yeah that's gonna blow my computer the hell up if I actually used that high of a bitrate. And, uh, because I was like, why is my uh, video lagging? And I was like, let me go check my big room real quick. And yeah, for some reason, it was at a uh, whopping 160,000. And two minutes in, about 50% of my CPU was being used. And I was like, yeah, that's not, that's not good. Okay. That's, what do you want? Mr. Matthews gave me a message for you. He said when it was convenient to head into Emerald Ranch. He's looking at a few business things there. Okay. Oh, he'll find something too. He always does. Will you be well now, Mr. Morgan? Thank you before you uh, rudely interrupted me there. But yes, stop talking about the audio save. <laughs> but uh... Yeah, so looks like we have a letter over here, and I'm pretty sure this is from Mary. So, um, let's go. Dutch, I am trying to record right now. Do you know what YouTube is? Do you play Call of Duty? No. Do you play Red Dead? No. It's the 1800s. So stop interrupting me. But uh, anyway, and also, I'm sorry for the lack of enthusiasm I had last episode. I just, I made that video like five minutes after I woke up. And uh, yeah, lesson learned, I'm not going to do that again. Because I was thinking of things to say. And uh, like I am right now. And uh, anyway. Morning, Arthur. Good morning. Stop interrupting me. Anyway, let's read this letter from Mary. Dear Arthur, I've written this letter a hundred times or more, and I cannot get it right. It's me. You know it's me from the bad handwriting. I know I said when we last spoke, and I was going off to get married, that we would not speak again. I know I said a lot of things, and I meant them, I suppose, at the time. But I'm not so proud as to not speak to people who care for me, or cared for me. I've been in Valentine for a couple of months. I had some bad luck and, well, it's a long story and not an interesting one, but I am here for now. I saw a couple of the girls or whatever the polite term is for them that ran Feels between bad. your associates in town. And I heard tell of a man who sounded like you. I would love to see you again. If you could spare me a little bit of your time, I'm renting a room at Chad's oh. farm, just north of Valentine. Yours, Mary Linton. Dude, I love Mary. From the missions I've done with her, like in the past, like first or second playthroughs, dude, I love her. She's sweet. Alright, let's see what old Dutch has going on. Dutch? Miss O'Shea? Well, feels like we are finally getting back on our feet. You, uh, find a buyer for them bonds we stole? Not yet, but Jose is working on it. When we heading west? Soon? I don't know. Feels like things have changed. The whole world's changed. They don't want folk like us no more. We're being hunted. We are smarter than them. Only the feeblest of men take jobs in the government <laughs> i hope so trust dutch mr morgan you have to they got my or do i know dutch Arthur. what's going on they got micah he he's been arrested for murder he was Good. in strawberry it's okay and... son breathe they nearly lynched me they they got micah and the sheriffs in strawberry and there's talk of hanging them here's open arthur what the fool brought this on himself. You know my feelings about him, Dutch. You think I can't see past his bluster to the heart inside? He is a fine man. No, I ain't saving that fool. I can't go. My face will be all over West Elizabeth. I am asking. 
He would do it for you. No, he wouldn't. He would, but no, he no. would not. Of course. You okay, Lenny? <laughs> yeah, of course I'm okay. You don't seem okay. You take that kid into town. Valentine, not Strawberry. Get him drunk. And Arthur? No crazy business. I've given that up. And you get Micah out of that jail. Come on, son. I'll get to it, Dutch. Just can't drop everything. Yeah, I'm glad Micah got arrested, but it looks like we're gonna have to go save him. And uh, for those who know, that's gonna come and uh, bite us in the arse later in the story. Alright, you coming, Lenny? Where are you? Jesus. Alright, let's ride. I rode as fast as I could, didn't stop for nothing. Yeah, you look like you've been through it. I'm beat. We finally get off that mountain, then this. Micah's got a crazy side off it. What were you boys doing? You're supposed to be scouting ahead for us. I kept asking him what we was doing, but he was, you worry too much, kid. Just, just some business to attend to, kid. You know how he is. Yes, I do. He was half soaked before we even got there. Then we ran into some fellas. One of them, Micah knew, drank some more. And this is supposed to be a dry town we're in, too. Then he shoots one of them. I know how that goes. Couldn't even tell you quite how. Happened like the strike of a match. The law was on us fast, too. They was ready to strangle me up there and then. But I got away, just about. Mm. You're all right now. We'll take care of it. So, so you gonna go get him? Sorry. I'll come with you. No, uh, you leave it to me. For now, let's drink some. Forget about Micah. It was drink that started all this. We'll just have a cup. Settle you down, then head back, okay? Okay. Now, I should warn you. Me and a couple of the other boys, we got in a bit of a fight last time. We yeah, we kind of destroyed the entire bar. No, nothing big. No, we kept it clean. We're all good. <laughs> If you say so, Arthur. No, he does not say so. That is not the truth. You coming good? Alright, let's uh, see what we got going on here. What the? Just one or two, right, Arthur? Of course, just a drink. No big drama. Can we get a couple beers, please? You, I don't want no trouble. And you'll get none from me. I was defending myself. Tommy, he's... He'll be fine. <laughs> you have one for yourself. Thank you. <laughs> mm. Micah seemed to know a lot of people. That was the problem. How you mean? I mean, I done seen a lot of crazy, crazy I stuff, but Micah... A lot Mikey... of crazy, crazy stuff. Will you shut up? Will you shut up? Be quiet, buddy. What is this guy doing right now? Oh, they're dullards. My lord. You men is dull. <laughs> no, you're just messing with us. Yeah, leave this fool alone. Leave the fool alone. Ooh, look at that face. Arthur wants to beat the living hell out of this guy. Listen, buddy, you're a charming fellow. One of the best. <laughs> but me and the kid here, we're trying to talk business, so could you possibly leave us alone? No offense intended. Ain't no pleasing some folk. I just noticed that Arthur's like bandana's gone. You can see like half his chest. What are you doing, Arthur? You're gonna get me age restricted. Well, <laughs> that's great, Martin. Lenny, Lenny, where are you? Oh, great, we lost to Lenny. <laughs> Lenny! Hey, Lenny! Lenny? Where is Lenny? Okay, where is Lenny? Lenny, where are you? Oh, there he is. What are you doing, man? 
Can't be just leaving us like that. What are you doing, kid? Hello, Arthur. You know what? I don't know. Oh. <laughs> 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 Oh. <laughs> what is Arthur doing? <laughs> Lenny? Lenny! Get away from me! Yeah. What slippery little shit ain't you? Oh, oh no! Get, yeah. We gotta go get Lenny. Lenny! Come on! Leave the kid alone, you goddamn animals! Well, who do you think you're talking to? Nobody. I'm talking to nobody. What did you say? What? I said, what did you say? Get lost, buddy. Shut up, mister. Yeah. Shut your mouth, mister. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> what? <laughs> and I thought I was going to get age restricted before. Oh my god, we are so drunk. Lenny! All of these people are Lenny. Lenny! Bastard! Okay, well, I, I think I remember what he's wearing, so I think I'm okay. Lenny? Lenny, is that you? Yeah, that's for sure, Lenny. Why are you so tall? Do I look like a Lenny to you? Oh, huh. Old hag. Is this Lenny? Could have been wearing that. We're looking all over for you, Lenny. How many have you had, pal? Yeah, one too many. Ugh. Uh, in here? Really? Oh shit! <laughs> no way! <laughs> no way! <laughs> We're on <a> goddamn door! <laughs> oh my god! Where is Lenny? This is for sure getting age restricted. You, Lenny? No. You, Lenny? You got the, wrong fella. the hell is happening? <laughs> Found you, Lenny. Huh? Is this Lenny? Lenny, I'm a boy. Lenny, what are you talking about? No. Lenny. Lenny. No, Lenny doesn't have gray hair. Lenny. Oh, Lenny. Lenny, where are you? Oh, there you are. Oh. What is this mission right now? <laughs> What is this mission? Oh my god. Oh great, this guy. Oh, we're drowning this guy. I don't want to do this, friend. Oh, he just punched us in the balls. That ain't even right, man. I mean, yeah, what we, what we were doing wasn't right either, but we're not going to talk about that. Oh, my great. Now we're getting all muddy. Oh, 
Oh my god, I can't even run that- oh crap. I can't even run like this. Oh crap, right, 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 right. Run, Arthur, run, Arthur, run, Arthur, run. Jump. Go, 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 go. Oh, holy crap, we actually made it. Uh, that was... Yeah. All I gotta, that's all I gotta say on that one, it's just... Yeah. Yeah, welcome back to reality, uh, Mr. Morgan. This has happened multiple times. You go, like, okay. Oh, okay, here we go. How far did we go? I think that's the place where I found Reverend. How did we get this far? No way Arthur actually ran that far. No way. No way Arthur ran that far. Um... Well, I guess next I'm gonna go talk to Hosea, so I will meet you guys when I'm over there. Over here! Now! Well, boys, looks like we're encountering some old Uriscals right now. Ah, oh, my god, okay, yo! Jesus, it's okay! Well, you guys are dying, so... Sorry, I was looking at my other monitor. This little varmint. Okay, now I will officially see you when I am at uh, Jose. Alright, guys, so on our way over to Emerald Ranch here where Jose is, we actually just ran into one of the debtors, so we are gonna go collect the debt from this guy. And then we'll go speak to Hosea. Although I think there's actually another debt to collect in Emerald Ranch with him too. Beechick Matthews. Oh no no not me sir. Uh, uh that's the green horn over there. Where? And there he goes. Oh, well I'm already on my horse so. I already got you. Hey, get back here. You owe us money. I already got you. Holy crap, we already got him. I think that was supposed to be a big chase. Look, <laughs> we already got him. <laughs> but it's hidden. Untie me and I'll tell you where it is. No, I'm just gonna loot you. God damn treasure hunt. You're lucky I ain't taking your teeth as well. Alright, there we go. Holy Moses. We'll cut him for you, why not? I didn't tell what I meant to do. Okay, that's not what I meant to do, but anyway. Where is my... Here's the map, though. That is not what I meant to do at all. If something happened to me, my worldly possessions are stored here. Okay. Oh, so... The, 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 looks like it's marked on the map. Um, looked like it was in a tree of some sorts. I don't know, maybe this guy thought it would be a good idea to, uh, you know, sorry, it was his valuables in a tree. And then, take loans from people. But, uh, as you can see, when you mess with the Vanderland gang, you know, that kind of catches up with you, that karma. So, um... Yeah, let's see if we can find this in this tree right here. I think this is the tree, right? Yeah, it's in this hole. How much should we get? Oh, they didn't even tell us. It looks like, 
Emerald Ranch is right down there. So I don't think I have to make any cuts or anything like that. I'll just go right there with you guys. So, um... So how you guys enjoying the series so far? This is we're already on episode seven. I can't I can't even believe that how well the series is going. Um, let me know if you guys um, want any other series after this. What I'm or during this, I'm actually thinking about uploading the first part tomorrow, and then I'll start double uploading this game and uh, the Modern Warfare 2 campaign 2022, uh, not 2009. I had the 2009 one, the remastered one. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have the original that I got. Put away with my old 360, but uh, yes, here's the other day. But yeah, I, yeah, I, plus I'd rather do the remastered one anyway, it just looks nicer. But uh, yeah, I'll I'll do the 2009 one like down the road or some type, but I'm thinking about doing the Modern Warfare 2 one. 2022. Well, let's collect the second and third and final debt. No, there's one more. Lily, where's our money? What? That loan you took. It's payday. I'm sorry. I don't have it right now. Well, then. I guess we got a big problem, don't we? Cooper, give him what you've got. I ain't giving him nothing except a lesson in damn miles. Yeah, well, you're not the one that's literally about to die. Come on. Yeah, what? Well, you don't not hurt someone in a fight. That's not how it works, lady. Knockout punch. Knockout, knockout, knockout. Knockout, 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 knockout. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. 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 There's your debt money. All right, so that's the third out of four debts that we need to get. Um, hey, you know what I do to things? Leave me alone, oh, don't you? I didn't steal that. It's a debt. Oh, damn it! Can a man have some peace? Great, stop. Stop. You're just desperate to lose. Don't make this difficult. All right Ooh. then. You get I didn't want to, to do this. Just so you know, you threw the he threw the first punch. Oh my god, I'm getting my ass beat right now. No, will you stop? Holy hell! Holy hell, dude! What a bitch! Oh my god! <laughs> dude! I was doing everything to get that guy. I can't wait to see it in the comments now. Oh, you suck at this game. This uh, blah 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 blah. I was doing everything I could, but the guy just would not go down. Now, without any eruptions, please, can we just go talk to Hosea? My God. Like, I tried to pull my gun out to pistol whip him, and he goes, nope, we're just going to go ahead and knock that out your hand like it's not even a problem. Some people, man. I want to run into the red circle so that I can get rid of it. I know how to work with good people, Seamus, and I work in the right way. Well, they all say that. I never met an idiot that called himself one. Arthur, this is Seamus. He's our new partner. I ain't no such thing. Perspective, new partner, if he likes us. Liking ain't the problem. Trusting is, as I said. Keep your voices down. I don't want my boss hearing. This is a sideline. Of course. Look at us. Honest as the day is long. Exactly. I'll tell you what. Let us prove ourselves. <laughs> prove ourselves? To this clown, what you talking about? Good day, Hosea. Good luck with your business dealings. Listen, uh, he's rough and ready and quick with his tongue, but I swear you can trust him and trust me. I'm an old man. You're not old, Seamus. I'm old enough. And you know why I ain't dead? You don't trust idiots. Exactly. We're not idiots. Let us prove it to you. 
Okay. I'll tell you what. Arthur. Old Bob Crawford and his boys just bought a beautiful stolen stagecoach from upstate. It's in their barn. Now, you go get that, and then we can work together. Who's old Bob Crawford? An acquaintance of mine. So you want us to take out your competition? Well, he, he's not just an acquaintance, but a cousin by marriage. I also want to see if you boys got what it takes. Now, you survived that. Where is he? Well, he's in a farmhouse just northwest of here called Carmody Dell. It's just up the train tracks as you're heading up towards Fort Wallace. There's also some money in that house, but that's your business, not mine. But don't kill nobody. Folks know we ain't intimate no more, and they'll know it was me. But you're fine with us robbing your cousin. By marriage. And yes, I'd love it. You heard the man. Let's go rob his cousin. By marriage. All right, then. That doesn't make much sense. But uh, let's go get the stagecoach for this guy. <laughs> that horse just took a massive really? steamer. Really? Lead the way. He said the place is just northwest of here. Me? The other one who's been out gallivanting around here. That's what you call it. Oh, clearly you've recovered from your bear encounter. Huh? That's uh, my bad, Jose. Could have played that better, couldn't you? Thought you wanted me here to show some strong arm. That's usually how it goes. Yes, but you know how this works. Come on, Jose. That feather's a joke. And that's why he's perfect. He won't cause us any problems. A safe spot to fence wagons and coaches? That's easy money for us. I Whatever you say. Right. Come on, it's not like he's asking us to rob a bank. If the two of us can't steal a stagecoach from Seamus' old crooked cousin by marriage, we should hang up our hats now. Okay, uh, Amort Ranch. Take you can with things. About things now. What things? This place. The gang. Been here a few weeks now. Good, I think. Better. I figured more folks would have cut and run on us, given everything that happened. Like Dutch always says, a lone wolf don't last long out on the plains. He does like to trot that one out. People see that, especially when they get a few years on them. Even someone like Micah. There's a couple of folks I wish had cut and run. Maybe they'd say the same about you. I wish Micah would just leave. Move! Alright, we are here, boys. That must be the place up ahead. We should go on foot from here. I mean, I'm already on Let's foot. Let's see what we're dealing with. Come on. <coughs> this is a nice place. I wouldn't mind living here. There's the house. I see the barn in the back. Stagecoach has to be in there. Okay. I'll hide behind this rock. Okay. Good, man. Let's take a quick look at the place. Someone on the porch. Well, yes. Okay. I reckon we can do it now. I'll head over, distract him by putting on a little show while you sneak into the house, find what you can, then get the stagecoach. Or wait until nightfall. Sneak in, then I'll get the coach. You can try the house. What do you think? Let's do it, Nate. Let's wait. I think it would just be smarter to do that night. Let's We're go. less visible. You go into the house. I'll go find this wagon. All right. Uh, I'll sneak into the house then. Maybe take a peek through the windows before you go in. Make sure it's all quiet. All right. I see some light actually. Just 
just a fire. I think we're good. No, we're not. I think I'm stuck. Okay. I think I hear someone sleeping. Rob the house. What if I don't... We got Kentucky bourbon. Uh, I guess I can't rob that. Usually there's stuff in the chimney. Ah, 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 I was right. $150. Alright, well, we just got like triple the money that we needed. <laughs> Okay, I was... We're being kind of loud right now. Okay, I was going to get on on that side. Alright, that was super easy. Let's just go fast, okay? Alright, I am spamming A right now and there's a train, damn it. Okay. My health is terrible right now. I need to eat this. The better right now. Just need to get this back to Seamus in one piece, and it's a good night's work. You're gonna crash if you don't slow down. Why? Well, yeah. A lift from the house. Found some money stashed away. Must be a few hundred. Not too bad. Not bad at all. Now we have enough money to go to Tahiti, as Dutch says. <laughs> no doubt. I won't forget that in a hurry. I'm looking forward to your retelling of that one around the campfire. It wasn't the first time Mr. Matthews had stared death in the eye. And as usual, he did not flinch. Yeah, exactly. How long do you think we're going to stick around here for? Not sure. Here we can't, I suppose. Feels like we're starting to get back on our feet, slowly but surely. Just need to keep at it. Dutch has a new money chest stashed in a safe spot away from camp, but it's a long way from being full. I hope it's not stashed in town like we did in Blackwater. Okay, here we are. Just pull the coach into the barn there. He should be waiting for us, right? Hmm. <laughs> Yep, there he is. Hello, Seamus. We met your cousins. How was it? Fine. Nice people. Mm. Park that thing in here. Quickly. All right. Uh, nice work, Hosea. It was mostly Arthur. Like I said, coarse but competent. Here. Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for them. But discreet, you know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp. Goodbye. I think you're coming. Yeah. Sure. And this cough. If you guys would like to see the stare right there, God, that was cringe. Oh my God. Oh my God. I can't, I am so sorry. Easy. Hey, we are back and ready for bed here at good old camp right now. Total take was 300. Okay. Oh, wow. Um, in Arthur's bank account, there's $288 right now. There's $1 in camp. Okay, well, let me fix that $1 in camp. I'm going to donate, like... I have 288 I am going to donate 200 Yeah, I'm going to donate 200 I think that's a reasonable amount. Give all debts as well. I forgot about those. Let's see how much I had to bring it up to. <laughs> 
$69. Okay. Contribute. Um, give money 200. Alright, we need to go like way down, not skip the way over 200. Uh, screw it. We'll just skip 140. So we'll just get basically half of the 280. Okay. Alright, guys, that's going to do for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. This is part 7. We are flying through this series. I actually am sad about that because I love this game, but. Uh, I am really happy that I'm getting episodes out and getting videos out daily. We are on like, God, seven, six day shriek right now. And that shriek is not going to end anytime soon. By the way, uh, happy New Year's Day to the people that celebrate that. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Hope you have a great New Year's Day. I hope you guys can accomplish those, uh, those New Year's resolutions if you have any. And... Uh, and it's